Hi guys, this is a tutorial on how to remove the background from your picture uh, using PaintShop Pro um, and I'm using X2 here. Uh, I'm going to show you how to do this two ways uh, and you choose which way to do it depending on your picture. If the background is very detailed uh, with lots of different colours in your picture, uh, you'll have to manually erase it. But if um, the picture just has a single colour as the background, like this one, you can just take a shortcut method and I'll show you how to do this first. So what you want to do is have your picture open and go over to this section on the right and uh, right click on it. Then click on promote background layer. That'll promote it to um, raster one. Then you want to go over to the left hand sidebar and click on this magic wand tool. If it isn't selected, click on this white arrow and then click on magic wand. Um, up here you'll see the tolerance section. Uh, 10 is a good number, any higher, um, yeah lower it. It's 10. 10 is good. Even a bit lower is fine. So now just click on the background, anywhere in the background. That will select it. Then just press delete. And there you go. Right click to get out of the selection. And there it is. So to save it, what you want to do is go to File, Export, PNG Optimizer, and then make sure in your transparency tab that it's um, checked on to alpha channel transparency down here in the what type of transparency do you want then just click OK save it and there you go and then it's saved onto your computer now I'll show you the, um, the method if your background is very detailed so this method is almost simpler than the, uh, the other method it is a bit longer and it is open to more mistakes because it's manual but the actual process is a bit simpler than the other method so first of all open up your new photo and then you just want to head over to the left hand side bar and click on the eraser tool to adjust the size of the eraser tool uh, hold down alt and then scroll your mouse up to make it smaller and down to make it larger. So to start with, have a fairly large size. Just click and hold to erase. And then when you get to the finer parts, um, you can go to a smaller size. So do the main parts that are fairly easy to quickly do. that and then uh, make the eraser tool slightly smaller and then do it a bit finer so this way isn't perfect but it's the best way out there and if there are obvious sections that are one color you can um, you can just use the magic wand like I showed you before but um, then you might need to use this method for the rest of it. So just keep getting finer and finer as you get closer and closer. And I recommend stopping and starting every now and then because if you accidentally go in and you press Ctrl Z and you've done this massive section without um, clicking off, you'll have to lose all of that work. So regularly click on and off. So, I think you get the idea. You can come fairly just over the um, the part you want to keep um, if your if your brush is uh, fairly large, then it will recognise that they're different colours and keep the object. That's pretty smart like that. So.
hope this helped. Thank you for watching, and watch out for uh, other videos by Nat Charger. Thank you.